Zach Creek. My name is Jonathan Castro. And I'm Gretchen DeRuzzi. Please stand for your morning pledges. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Honor the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to thee, Texas, one state under God, one and indivisible. And now for a moment of silence. Students, please check the walls outside of the finance and attendance offices. If you have outstanding fees or fines, they will be posted in one of these locations. These lists do not include the library, so please make sure you check with the library as well. Please be aware, you will not be able to pick your exemption card for finals until all outstanding fees and fines before school, after school, and during your lunch period. No students will be released from the class to resolve these issues. Tis the season to be tacky, y'all. Come to Bahama Bucks December 16th from 6 to 9 p.m. for Cy Creek Tacky Christmas Sweater Party. Seniors, this is a fundraiser for prom. Everyone is invited. There will be prizes for the tackiest sweater. Cougars for Christ is hosting an annual United States Marine Corps Toys for Tots drive. Please bring new unwrapped toys to the boxes located in the flex areas around the school and at the front desk from December 8th through December 16th. Thank you for making a difference in a child's Christmas. The Side Creek Theater Department competed at the Texas Thespian State Festival this past weekend in Dallas, and 12 of our competitors have advanced to the national competition. Congratulations to Z Bolivar and Casey Jackson in duet musical, Cody Brockermeyer, Yasmin Kaskar, Sydney Perry, and Autumn Shelton in group acting, Natalie Barsenas in scenic design, Ali Fleischauer in solo musical, Cortland Parisher in solo musical, Allison McLean in stage management, Sam Sandaz in stage management, and Deborah Cook in theater marketing. They will be competing at the national level at the Thespian Festival in Lincoln, Nebraska this summer. Hey guys, did you miss the auditions for Greece? Wish you could go back in time and audition? Now's your chance. The theater department is holding a second chance audition today at 2.45 in the LGI 1. Auditions are for males only, no prepared piece necessary, and we'll tell you what to sing. Side Creek Band will be having their winter concert on December 14th at 7 p.m. in the Side Creek Auditorium. Please come out and support the band by enjoying their holiday music. If you are interested in a more personal touch in celebrating the holidays, please think about Christmas carols performed by the Side Creek Band members through December 20th, $30 an appointment. Contact Brian Drake to schedule your holiday music. Make sure you get your ticket to the annual Mrs. Side Creek pageant. The pageant is tonight at 7 o'clock in the auditorium. There will be all sorts of entertainment including Sylvie's, cheerleaders, and of course the holiday hunks with their arm candy. Tickets are on sale at all lunches for $10. You can also buy them from a Sylvie for $8. Johnny Two Muscles, get out there and show them that lean, mean physique. When you're done cleaning yourself up, you get out there all dapper and clean and mean looking. Tweedledee and Tweedledum work, there you are. Vote for Jackson Tompkins. Take action. Vote for Jackson. Hi, I'm Eric Eastep. And I'm Mark Campbell. And here's what's going on in Side Creek Sports. Last week, the varsity Side Creek girls basketball team beat Katie Taylor 37-31. Nice job, guys. The Side Creek boys varsity basketball team defeated Tombaugh Memorial 58-38 last Tuesday. The varsity wrestling team participated in the Sire Ridge Classic on November 20th and 21st. The following wrestlers won their matches. Eugenia Contreras, Sarah Metz, Jordan Rinkin, Alyssa Sheik, Cameron O'Brien, Jacob Elliott, 
Jeremy Gomez, Jacob Gonzalez, Christopher Jagat Narain, Tommy Martin, Felix Martinez, and Daniel Pena. Tommy Martin placed fourth, Christopher Jagat Narain, and Felix Martinez placed fifth. The varsity wrestling team also participated in the Woodlands Invitational held on December 4th and 5th. The following wrestlers won their matches Yesenia Contreras, Sarah Metz, Jasmine Nichols, Jordan Rincon, Jeremy Gomez, Jacob Gonzalez, Kenneth Lukowski, Christopher Jagat Narain, and Tommy Martin. Sarah Metz and Jordan Rincon both placed fifth. Next up, the varsity wrestling team competes in the state dual qualifier on December 12th at Cy Woods. And that's it for Cy Creek Sports. I'm Eric Eastad. And I'm Mark Campbell. We'll see you next time. Sister Mary Kenneth Keller was the first woman to earn her PhD in computer science at the University of Wisconsin in 1965. She held a Bachelor of Science in Math and a Master of Science in Physics and Math from DePaul University. She developed the computer language BASIC and founded the Computer Science Department at Clark College in Iowa. She said, For the first time, we can mechanically simulate the cognitive process. We can make studies in artificial intelligence. Beyond that, this mechanism can be used to assist humans in learning. As we are going to have more mature students in greater numbers as time goes on, this type of teaching will be increasingly important. beforehand, upload it to the to the robot slash whatever control brick, and then we basically just set it up, press the start button, and it has to run by itself. What's different about these robots than the robot wars and stuff that you might see on TV is these ones require the use of artificial intelligence. So if you look at these robots, it's hands off, hands free. There's no remote control. So when they're programming them, they have to think of all of the possible conditions before they start the robot. Once they push the start button on the robot, the robot has to complete all of the assigned tasks without any intervention from the user. That's what makes it a much more advanced academic or intellectual kind of task. Thanks for watching this edition of This Geek Week at Creek. My name is Jonathan Castro. And I'm Gretchen Rizzi. Happy Holidays, Creek.